Hey, this is Matthew Jeske here, and I'm just doing a review of a bunch of books I read last year and some camera stuff I played with. Now, this is Trump, Think Like a Billionaire. I was uh, recommended this book by Shoe Money. His, um, he's a big internet marketer that I ha tend to um, like and follow. Um, he said this was a fantastic book and everybody should read it, but... What I did is I, I share a lot of books with another entrepreneurial friend of mine, and he read it first. <laughs> and I should have thought before I bought the book to not just go on Chew Money's um, recommendation. I should have thought to read the Amazon reviews. Brian read this on the plane while he was flying to um, the Virgin Islands. He got a trip there for free because he's a really awesome entrepreneur. wish I was as good as him. But um, he read this, and he said that, it was so terrible, he would have done me a favor if he would have burned it and never even gave it back to me. And I trust Brian's opinion, so I did not read the book. Now, does this reflect on my opinion of Trump? Um, not necessarily. I think Trump is a really amazing businessman. I mean, you have to be if you're going to be worth billions of dollars. But what Brian told me was this is really, this offered no insight into business ideas. It was completely valueless. He took absolutely nothing away from it. Both of us were kind of thinking Trump made his billions through real estate. We're kind of thinking he would explain some of his thoughts and things that he did to get there. But Brian said they didn't mention a thing about any of that. Uh, shame on you, Trump. Like, if you write another book, write something of value. He said... This is basically uh, Trump talking about um, what clothes you should wear, what type of cars you should drive, all the egotistical like things that are almost valueless when it comes to building a business. Um, it was just like celebrity gossip bullshit. And uh, we, ha we actually thought, maybe we will, about doing a controversial video to see if people would actually just flock to this book like mad, um, are, are the review like mad and share it like mad, because I read, I read this book here, oh, I love this book, I, I cannot tell you how much I love this book, it's called Trust Me I'm Lying, uh, Confessions of a Media Manipulator, I'll put the link to buy this below, but this is all about controversy, controversy, and how to drive and get attention in your advertising and in life, I suppose, you know, become a celebrity sort of thing. Um, but what we thought we could do is use this book to invoke controversial um, things and, or to create a controversial review, drive a lot of people to the book, who then in turn buy a different book instead. And what we're going to do is, like, we're going to burn the book and maybe, like, fake take a leak on it or something. I mean, <laughs> that's horrible, but that's super, super controversial at the same time. And I think it would really provoke people to say one thing like, I don't like Trump, or I do like Trump, you're a jerk. And then um, possibly drive some people to buy a different book or this book. I don't know. But um, that said, I do not recommend buying this book. Don't waste your time on it. Listen to the reviews. Terrible book um, to, to get business ideas from. Now, if you like just finding out the egotistical things that, I don't know, you might do if you're a billionaire and you had no sense for money, and you love watching celebrity gossip, okay, like... Maybe this book is all right for you. So I'm going to provide a link where you can buy Trump's book, How to Think Like a Billionaire. I'm also going to provide a link to this book, which I'll, I'll do a review for that in a separate video. This is an awesome book. Trust me, I'm lying. Confessions of a Media Manipulator. Love this book. Um, this one, not so much. Um, we might burn it, actually. So just look directly below the video. The links will be for both of these. Uh, to buy this book and to get a review of Trust Me, I'm Lying. Now, I do make a pittance. I make, like, enough money I can maybe buy a pop or, like, half a pop <laughs> if you buy one of these books. Um, if that upsets you or offends you, um, go to Amazon directly 
Just type in www.amazon.com and buy the book there on your own. It costs you the exact same. But if you do buy through my links, I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy the review. If you have some comments, um, put it directly below the video. Thanks.